Hi guys, it's Aaliyah. Welcome back to my channel. So this video really has no theme or purpose to it. I just, um, I got these, they're watercolor or water-based, or water, I don't know, watercolor markers. Um, and I've never used them before. I just got them, I got them actually on Amazon. And, um, I kind of want to just see what they do because, well, I got these, you remember a few videos ago I showed, I bought these little, um, dolls, um, for, well, originally I bought them from a mini moose, but then I realized there's some that are bigger, so, uh, which is fine, but they're not colored. And I thought it would be really cute because I noticed when Lolly does all her little, um, a lot of her little projects especially when it comes to like paper dolls and stuff like that um, she does color on them so I mean I don't have the markers and stuff that she does but I thought it might be fun however I've never like I don't know I mean I don't know what the difference between a regular marker and these are I guess I I mean to me it just feels like a regular marker um, let's see. I mean, I guess they're just regular markers. I don't know. So, I what I thought, it would be kind of fun to see if we can um, color maybe one of the bigger ones for now. Let's just take one. I'm just going to pull him out. Let me see. How close am I? Not very close. Okay, hold on. So if I just keep him on there, I should be able to color him. All right, so let's see. What color pants should he have? Um, no, actually, let's do, because there's a gray here. Let's do his socks first. And I mean, I don't really color very often, but we're just coloring his socks a little bit. Maybe this duck color was a little too dark that's okay all right well <laughs> that was interesting let's give him some hmm maybe let's go kind of bright let's give him a nice no we'll do this color shirt right let's try no I have an idea he has a little bow tie. So let's kind of color in his bow tie first. This is kind of dark. And I do have my reading glasses on, but I feel like I still can't really see. And this is one of the bigger ones, so one of the smaller little dolls, the paper dolls that I have. Aish, it's gonna be a gonna be a big challenge, I think. Alright, so let's do there's a fine tip, so let me see if I can do leaves and a fine tip. I mean, I'm just not the great at coloring. Especially, apparently, in the lines. <laughs> I don't know. Well, this will be a fun uh, little project here. Hold on. I got to hold this up to me for a second. All right. There's a little stem here. Okay. <laughs> well, this is fun. Um, I don't know how I feel. These aren't really watercolor. These are just markers, basically. So that's all right. We're going to just have a little bit of fun coloring in this little dude. I think, you know what it is? Maybe the colors are just bold. Because see this green is actually, I don't mind it. It's a very light shade of uh, like a green. Let's see, do this and do that. 
Okay. Oh, we gotta get his back right there. All right, so let me see. What color should his pants be? Uh, I mean, maybe he could have blue pants, but I think the blue is gonna be really bold. The gray is too dark. This is another gray, but I feel like that'll be dark too. Hmm, I mean, we could do the purple, but it's gonna just be really colorful. Maybe let's just do brown pants. It's gonna be dark, but you know what? That's all right. Maybe I should have used the fine tip to kind of outline. I don't know. I mean, I'm not really much of a person that likes to color. However, I don't really want to say that because I did go through this time, or not this time, but this period, um, I don't remember, it was like several years ago, where, you know how you can just go online and print out, um, like, blank adult coloring pages, and uh, I used to print so many of them out, and I would just sit in my free time, or when I was watching TV, or, you know, kind of whenever, and I um, would color them. I have, like, stacks of them. So, and they were color pencils, so it wasn't marker that I was doing it with. Um, and uh, I did have a lot of fun, so I can't say that I don't like to color, but I'm not, well, currently, I uh, haven't really colored much. Okay, so, actually the brown pants look pretty nice. Let me just kind of even out that. Okay. But now he needs like a little belt. How about just red? A little red belt. Because I think that's a belt. I don't know. It's going to be a belt. We're going to make it a belt. So. I'm just going to color in here. I mean it is. These are nice because they do have the um, fine tip and then like the brush type tip. So that's kind of fun. Okay, and you know what we're going to do? I'm just going to kind of give a little brown hairs. There we go. <laughs> so, I mean, these aren't bad. These aren't really what I was thinking of when I ordered them however I do like the fine tip and then the brush tip just probably not for something so small and not that these are so small because these are you know the bigger ones of the little um, paper dolls that I got but for me personally I have a hard time with little spaces which is kind of comical because my favorite things are mini moo cards but I mean like to color in and stuff and stay within the lines I do have a little bit of trouble there so but I mean he's pretty cute I'm going to definitely use him on something and I wonder if we should like paint the background no of course not why would we paint the background when we can just distress it because you know distress is my middle name I don't think my parents know that, but I, I should let them know. It's Aaliyah Distress Dapina. <laughs> Distress everything, Dapina. <laughs> oh, gosh. I love my distressing. Yep, much better. <laughs> Look at him now. What do you guys think? Yeah, that's definitely more of... Am I even in frame? Hold on. Maybe I should stand up. Yep, there he is. So, I mean, you can see like right here, I'm not perfect with my coloring, but that's all right because we were just sort of playing around with this just to see how it would come out. And it's not bad. Oh my gosh, but he's so cute. So cute. So these markers are good for people that um, can color within the lines. Um, but I do, like I said before, I do like the two, the two tips, the fine and the brush, because that does make it a little easier when you do have a fine tip. So I will be using them for other projects. I'm not sure exactly what, 
but um they were fun i think and i mean they weren't very expensive i think this is another one of the things i got on the tax-free weekend i think they were like 4.99 so um not that i wasted a bunch of money because i will definitely use them but unfortunately it wasn't what i was really thinking of but that's okay too because you never know and you know you always want to have some markers on hand anyway so and it has all the primary colors which is really nice so I think that is it for this video. Um, I mean, thanks for coming along just to kind of play with my new markers and uh, do a little coloring. Um, I actually kind of like that. Now I kind of want to do another one. So I probably will do another one once I turn the camera off. Maybe a bigger one than him. One of the bigger um, little paper dolls, but who knows. So that is my little adventure with my new markers today. As always, thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in my next video. Bye.